Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're interested in seeing what I made for this week, then just keep on watching. My best friend gave me these canvases a while ago because she no longer wanted them and I'm just now getting a idea on exactly what to do with them. So now I'm outside and I'm gonna be using my white semi-gloss spray paint to cover them. Next, I'm using these 500 puzzle pieces that I purchased from the Dollar Tree and I'm just laying them all out before covering them with my black acrylic paint. Okay y'all, so this part was a little time consuming because I did cover all 500 pieces just like this simply because I didn't have any more black spray paint on hand and I didn't feel like going to the store to get more. But your girl got patience sometimes. But if you're going to recreate this, then of course you can spray paint all the pieces to save yourself some time. Not sure if you guys can see this, but there are some imperfections. So I'm going to go over my canvases with this white acrylic paint. Now I'm taking my puzzle pieces and I'm going to glue them to my canvas with my hot glue. I'm using very little glue because these puzzle pieces are small and I didn't want the glue seeping out from the sides and I didn't have a particular pattern. I'm just simply placing a puzzle piece anywhere. Okay, so for project number two, I was like, let me take this box and just make a table to go with my canvases. But as I got to spraying, I was like, mm, this is not gonna work. I ended up going to the store anyway to get more of this black semi-gloss spray paint. And all I'm gonna do is spray paint the edges of my box. Now I'm going to be using these poster boards that I purchased from the Dollar Tree and I'm going to use my Sharpie to trace around my box. I only purchased four poster boards and I didn't have enough left so this piece right here will be for the top of my box. I'm using this tacky glue to adhere the poster boards to my box. If you're going to recreate this project, you can use foam boards for an alternative. I'm back outside and I'm gonna be using my black semi-gloss spray paint to cover all my beaded necklaces. For this step, I'm just gonna glue all the necklaces around the perimeter of my canvases. 
don't know if y'all can tell but the spray paint didn't fully cover my necklaces so off camera i'm just going to take a container spray some spray paint in there and take a foam brush and just go over my necklaces Now I'm gonna get started on my box, AKA my coffee table. I'm just gonna take those same puzzle pieces and I'm gonna glue them all over my box. Now that I'm done gluing all the puzzle pieces on, I'm gonna glue my necklaces to the edges of my box. Once I was done gluing all my necklaces down, I removed any excess glue strings from my canvases and my table, and then I had something that looked like this. It's amazing what you can do with Dollar Tree items. I used almost all of the 500 puzzle pieces, and I think this week's projects turned out absolutely gorgeous. But tell me what y'all think. Please like, comment, and share. And if you're curious to see what else I can create, hit that subscribe button and turn on your notifications so you don't miss my next video.